This match has been described as the last hope of the Arabs. Morocco is going head to head with Spain here at Education City for that all important spot in the quarterfinal. No Arab team has ever won the World Cup, and the Atlas Lions are the last Arab team standing. It's fair to say the entire region is united and holding its breath today. Morocco is the, the last hope for us as Arab. I, I, I'm from Yemen and uh, I think there is uh, I, I unify behind we are all supporting Morocco team. It's not only the last Arabic country, it's the last African country too. So I think everybody is sharing for us. The good thing about Qatar, like uh, getting all Arabs together, one nation, you know. The nation is coming here to support one country that absolutely like reunited for one thing and it's football. We forgot all the borders, all the problems, all the things that they are talking about and now all we are uh, united behind the Morocco team and we, we hope so that they will do something great today. Great. The amount of like Marroquis are supporting in Morocco is amazing. Wow, I never thought that I would see so many. Good luck for both of us. We're gonna play well and we're gonna play well. Yeah, I think Today, today, Moroccan, they made the history. Today's match was extremely nervous. We were on our nerves. We didn't know if the match will, will finish by Morocco winning. And when I say Morocco, it's Arabs because we were the only Arabs. In the end of the day, we win 3-0. Not all, only Moroccans are happy, but all World up are happy. What a major shift of tides at Qatar 2022. The region's very own Morocco claimed a well-fought victory over footballing giant Spain, battling all the way to the end with a 3-0 win and penalties. You can see what it means for the mass crowds here tonight. Cheers and celebrations are popping up not only across Qatar, but around the region to celebrate the only Arab team still standing at the World Cup. Whoa!